doors closing, going down. Third floor. Doors closing, going down. Yes, you're all going down with bugs. Because the man in the blue jacket sneezed and spread his germs everywhere. Mr. Sizemore, I have to go talk to him about some old school stuff. What about our social studies project? Um, you know, I'll give you my number, and you can just give me a call later, okay? Okay. Hey, Evan, if I tell you something, you promise not to tell? What? What is it? Marie is a total tease. She flirts with guys just to get something. Then she talks about them behind their back. Yeah? Yeah. She's just using you for that project. Better watch out. Now what we have here is the um, differential equation which will become our logistic function. Now to show that, I'm first of all going to change the, uh, the term in brackets into a single fraction. So the common denominator is A, I end up with A take P. Next we need to remember that um, this is a separable equation. The P term needs to be across here on the left hand side. So if I move um, the right hand side terms except for the K across to the left, then my fraction will be inverted. So A on A take P and my value of p here will also occur now on the denominator. Now in order to progress further we need to make use of uh, this particular um, equation over here. So my fraction I have here, which is what I have on the left hand side down here, can be rewritten in this form. To show that, if I were to consider here the right hand side, if I'm adding two fractions, I need a common denominator, so I can multiply P and A take P. Then the A take P multiplies the 1 here, and the P multiplies the 1 there. And we can see that the minus P and the plus P cancel out, and we're left with A over P times by A take P, which is the left-hand side. So I've now rewritten my equation with the two separate fractions, as we can see down here. Now we integrate both sides with respect to t. And we know that that expression there will simplify to the p. And the right hand side, we can integrate that with respect to t. We get kt plus c. And we'll leave the left hand side alone for the moment. Now, integrating um, 1 on P with respect to P, I end up with ln of mod P. And the uh, next fraction would be ln of mod A take P divided by the negative 1 that comes from the derivative of negative P. Now, we've got uh, the subtraction of two logarithms. We can express that as a single logarithm. So we divide P and A take P in the modulus. When we determine the log of a number, what we end up with here is the power. So P on A take P in the modulus is equal to E to the KT times by E to the C. We can split the uh, power into two parts. All right, so let's uh, look at this uh, equation here. What we can do is um, get rid of the modulus. So the term in the modulus could be positive or negative. So we can move the plus or minus to the right-hand side. And what I'm going to do is put it on the uh, EC, which is going to be a constant. A bit of a trick here is we invert uh, both sides. So A take P divided by P is equal to. Now if we invert that constant, it remains a constant. I'm going to call it B. If we invert this expression here, the power becomes negative. 
Now on the left hand side we have the, that single fraction. I'm going to now split it into two. So I have A on P, take away one. Move the one across the other side where it will add. And now the P will multiply across here and at the same time the 1 plus b, etc., will divide over here. So they'll swap positions. Which gives us our equation, and you may recognize that as the logistic equation we began with, which we can see is there. Now, I made mention previously about uh, a rumor. So the rumor problem, we have um, people who either know the rumor or don't, and we have a differential equation, which is in this form here, where R is the number that know the rumor, and A take R, the number that don't know the rumor. Now, that equation will give us the same um, logistic function if we were to integrate. So it's another example. Um, and this equation here would be the result if we were to begin with our equation there.